that's all. What we're going to have inside is our USB-C cable. USB-C on both sides. This is going to supply power and internet from the printer to the terminal. Absolutely fantastic. Makes cable management very easy. Also makes it look very clean looking. Get our printer pulled out. Pull off the back of it. And you'll see all of our little ports that we have in here. So we're going to have our red one for the two terminal. You have your two Ethernet out ports. You have your internet in port. And you have your power. And then in the bottom right corner, you're going to see your insert for the cash drawer. And it has it nicely labeled and the color coding. Once that is done, we can get our cable for our terminal inserted. Throw that on the bottom of this. Nice little grooves to situate the cable so you don't have to worry about it flopping around uneven. And then we're going to do our power pack. Right. Now that we have at least our initial cabling done, what we can do is get all this kind of thing. We'll get our Ethernet cable ran to our switch. The TP200s have a nice little openings on the sides of them so that you can run your cables alongside of it and also put the faceplate on the back of it when you're done. From here, we're going to take our internet in and we're going to run it to our switch that we've already installed. So we have our Pronto router. We have a nice little blue cable ran by the customer already. I'm going to throw that in any of the ports that say LAN, which is these three right here. The cable then runs over to here, which is just going to be our PoE switch, which is absolutely fantastic, which is going to help with the access points later for our handhelds. So, once we get our Ethernet cord plugged in, the main thing that you're looking for on this is going to be communication, right? So when you see the green lights, that means that they are talking to each other. We have, do not have power yet for our terminal, so they are not talking to each other yet. So we are going to send some power to this bad boy. And I believe we have some power right here. First time you get everything powered up, you're going to hear that beeping because we have to open up our printer. Get out the printer roll. The notification is also let you know that you're either out of paper or there is an error with the printer. Unwrap that. We're going to do tops over the top towards you. And flat. Fold it into the printer. Close the drawer. Good to go. And now, if you're looking at the terminal, you have two buttons on the back, which I'll show you. Right here. You can take this, hold down the one on the right for about two seconds, and you are going to power up your toast system. Easy as that.